going to take a little trip from the civilized part of the house. In other words, uh, bits that we finished one and a half years ago when we moved in and uh, take a look at the bit where usually there's a curtain hanging over so I don't have to look at it. But uh, last weekend I started uh, doing stuff in here. So this will be the master bathroom eventually, um, right where all the bedrooms are. And um, we haven't really done anything here, but uh, it's not what I want to look at now. But when it's done, it's going to be great. But here we have a stairs, which is not going to stay there. And uh, if I go on up here, so I'm going up in the air in the future bathroom. Now looking down into it, uh, so the water pipes and everything are there ready for plumbing. Um, but now we're in the attic space. Um, what I've been doing since uh, Saturday, did a good few hours on Saturday and then a couple of hours each evening, uh, is doing the under construction on the floor, pretty much like I did in all the other rooms downstairs. So the oak beams are all really uneven and uh, need some under construction to basically level it all out. And uh, yeah, if we take a look in the corner here, just to show the, the variation of height between the original beams, in this corner, I've actually sunk these four by six uh, centimeter timbers, uh, sunk it into there, so uh, we don't lose too much height. But in the middle here, then we have these blocks and wedges, and uh, they're about eight centimeters high. So between four centimeters down into the beam and uh, four centimeters down from there, that's like 12 centimeter difference between the highest part of this uh, place and the lowest part of the beam so we always have to choose the highest part um, unfortunately by sinking as well managed to win four centimeters this isn't too bad so it's quite low here um, I'm not that tall I guess so I, I fit kind of comfortably uh, this beam here might once the flooring is in uh, might be just rubbing the top of my head off that but um, yeah, that's okay. This is mainly going to be storage. We could put a guest room up here and it's not just here. This this room measures seven by five meters, roughly. Um, although um, where those larger timbers are uh, running at a right angle there, there's going to be a wall there which will block off the bathroom. So you won't be able to look down on somebody having a shower or taking a crap, um, which means that that stairs has to go, meaning we have to break through this wall somewhere and um, I think we might do what we did before downstairs and basically it's a little bit dark here uh, yeah, it's hard to see with that contrast there but uh, just in the middle of the frame there's a cross beam I could cut that out to make a kind of a triangular shaped opening um, that, to walk through so it's not actually a door and this wall will remain half timbered uh, so we'll do the uh, clay plastering like we did in the other places downstairs. This gable wall, um, all those pipes that are there, they're ducting. Um, that's leading down to a heating manifold, so a distributor for the wall heating. And I was going to uh, basically panel this wall over with uh, OSB sheets and then the wall heating elements and then plaster over it up this high in the house all the heat comes up here and I don't know if it's actually needed um, it would be probably easier and more attractive if I cleaned off those timbers and uh, did clay plastering between them leaving the timbers actually visible so that's something to do um, you can see right up to the apex uh, this will be partially closed off to give more storage space uh, but otherwise yeah and then the, the inner surface of the roof there uh, has to be done as well with I don't know, plasterboard or whatever, I haven't decided yet. Um, this is mirrored over the other side. And please excuse the mess. So this is where we've been storing stuff and this is why we need storage. So uh, this is stuff, some stuff we haven't unpacked since we moved over to Germany, I think. And Christmas decorations and uh, winter clothes, whatever. Um, so the same process has to happen over there. But this time, uh, the stairs that's there, that will remain and that would be the way up so i need to do the flooring there heating is already in there so that end is plastered uh, that was a brick wall uh, so we insulated it from the inside and uh, plastered it uh, with the wall heating uh, but basically same treatment over there 
So that's what we're doing at the moment. Uh, it feels good to be doing something a bit more physical again and work off uh, a kilo or maybe two, uh, sweating up here in the heat. Um, but that's where we are now, yeah. So uh, we go on holiday in a week. Uh, let's see how far I get before we do that.